Hi guys, it's Tuesday, so it's exactly one week since I made the video of me coming back on track. And I'm just going to skip to it really quick. I have lost five pounds. I can't believe it. I'm down to 229. This, basically, my scale keeps jumping from 229 to 229.04. Uh, cause I'm kind of a scale junkie. I mentioned that in my previous videos. So, um, that's why meetings are important, but I just, I can't afford it right now. I don't know anybody here anyway, so I'm like, uh, I'm just going to try to do all this. I, um, I did some things. This is what I did to lose weight. Okay. Oh, let me say your first few losses are going to be higher because if you read any of your Weight Watcher materials or any weight loss things, it tells you that um, usually, you know, you're, you have built up glycogen that uh, gets released once you start moving. You know, your body gets sedentary and then it turns into uh, fat, fat storage and that uh, is glycogen. You know, and it has to do with your, your sugars, your carbohydrates, whatnot. Let's put it in very simple terms. And when you start to burn, you know, use um, your energy storage, which is your fat as well, then your glycogen that you had built up, it gets turned into water. So you lose a lot of water weight at first. Um, so don't expect a big loss every week. And, and I'm actually really surprised about this one, but it's because... 234 is my biggest weight I've ever been, <laughs> even when I was nine months pregnant with my third child. So, uh, okay. So, uh, with that being said, okay, so this is what I did because I want to make this video as short as possible, if we can do that. I went to the dollar store uh, because I needed a new planner. And, you know, the dollar store is the cheapest route I can go. I get most of my things from the dollar stores. Okay, so I went to the dollar store and I bought a 200 page little notebook. You know, it's a spiral notebook. That way it can be like a three month planner. Well, it's gonna be a little more than three months, but. And then um, that's for my journaling and whatnot. And then I also bought a uh, 2013 and 14 planner. Uh, so. I, um, I ended up, I kind of made myself, you know, I wrote down the weeks. I made myself some goals every 5%, you know, 5%, 10%, 15%, 20%. Those are small goals to work towards, which leads to your long-term goal. So, you know, in any birthdays, anything that I think is going to be a challenge or whatever, weight loss related is this going to be this, this calendar. I have a goal in mind, but it's not a big deal, okay? If it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen, whatever, okay? So my goal in mind is the end of May, where I would like to be at or close to goal, okay? So it's good to have a long-term, short-term goals, whatever it is, okay? And then um, I also wanted stickers because my husband thinks I was silly, but you no, know, I'm telling you the motivation you know, tools that you get in meetings or whatnot, it really helps. Okay. So this was a good deal for a dollar. It was 424 stickers. And that way I can put down, it's got tiny ones, big ones, whatever it all says, little style, smiley faces and, and you know, some are sparkles and they're tiny ones. So I can put it down to, Oh, I drank enough water. Give myself a sticker. I did this, you know, so it's, that's motivating. And then I decided it's, and I've told people this as advice and it, you know, I've had previous bookmarks. It's nice to get yourself a bookmark or get one from your meeting, depending on how you're doing the program. Uh, it doesn't have to be Weight Watchers. Okay. Just so you know, but anyway, um, however you're doing it and just give yourself visuals help and they're kind of rewarding when you're all done. So I had one that every time you have, you lose five pounds, then you get a sticker from the meeting. and that's your five pound star. Well, I'm going to give myself a five pound um, smiley face. This says, well done. Okay. 
I'm not gonna say great job because it's a little easier the first week, but I have tons of them, okay? So it's just some visuals. So that's what I did from the dollar store. And um, as far as my tracking, tracking is important. I have been racking my brain and I'm done looking at all my past videos. I've been watching, reading all my past journals. Thank goodness I kept journals. I wish I would have kept them a little more detailed, but at least it was there. And um, I've been trying to learn from how I did it before, okay? I do not plan on going to a gym. My husband um, was kind of, he's offered to let me go to this gym that's down the road. But why should I? I have a pool. I have resistance bands. These are the resistance bands I was talking about. There are many exercises you can find to do on YouTube. They were, this is only half the package because it came with this nice little case, um, you know, that keeps it in. My husband actually picked these out for me a month ago, which I just started using. So he supports me in anything I do, and it was actually his idea. So it was kind of his way of, hey, why don't you work out? But he didn't want to say it, okay? So he, so he was trying to make it like my idea. Oh, I know you'd like these. And I'm like, yeah. So <laughs> that's how it went when we were walking through the store. $20 at Walmart, and that's half the package, it, and it comes with a beginner and a um, medium, and so, um, and then they come with, you stick them in the door jam, and uh, it actually works you pretty good. So there's lots of different exercises you can find, and I just try to switch them up a lot. Whatever you think you can do in the, in the gym, this is a lot better, especially if you're just getting started and you don't want to work out around people or you can't do anything because your kids are running around or you just, whatever the case is, or you're going traveling, okay? Um, whatever it is, you know, these you could do at any time, stick it in the door jam and just, you know, there's lots of different things you can do, you know, and you can work your, um, your abdominals. It has these little handles. So anyway. And swimming. I've been doing a lot of swimming. I can't go walking. I'm kind of a scared to go walking around here. I live in Florida. Um, there's a lot of things going on in Florida. Like, uh, I think it's a shoot to kill state. And I just don't like the stain your ground thing. And I don't want to be shot. Okay, so I have to stay in my little gated community. It's not really gated, but it's, it's protected by cameras and security so <laughs> I'm gonna stay right in here and also there's weird homeless people oh and crazy old senile drivers <laughs> and I mean that okay lots of people are on medications down here so it's kind of scary so swimming is makes a good workout and uh, uh, yeah so I lost so I hope you lost too and I'll be seeing less of you next week all right bye